Hey guys, it's Barry Glasgow here once again. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm going to talk briefly about SmackDown 1000. Yes, it's about a week late. Um, I'm not even going to bother doing a whole bunch of shit on this because this fucking program sucked. For a special 1000 moment, this has got to be one of the worst fucking programs they had had. Um, upper management was not pleased with the ratings. Well, you should be just fucking pleased. You know why? It sucked. Alright, let's get through some of the images here. Yeah, I mean, shit. Smack Dive Live, Bill. Hell, you didn't even have Chris Jericho. I don't know why he was on the fucking thing. You didn't have The Rock. He wasn't there. Um, you had a fucking Evolution back. You had Batista. Ric Flair. Um, Triple H back. Also doing a DX fucking thing. Uh, of all times, a DX, and you're going to bring back Evolution. And then Randy Orton. Uh, did they do anything? No, they just him hauled around. Ha ha, I remember dot 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 dot. That's all the fucking day was. Dot dot dot. I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember. Quick fucking flashbacks. If you're, you you should have made this a three hour fucking show if you're going to do all that shit. I mean, you didn't. The only thing, you had, the only thing I really got excited was when Batista told Triple H, well, you never beat me. You should have fucking done it and you didn't do anything with it. Have. I kept waiting for when they were doing their all high five and stuff at the end when they were, they were rolling off, getting ready to go off the screen. I kept waiting for Batista to deck the fuck out of Triple H and do something. Fuck, goddamn, they had a perfect company and nothing. Again, they could have another faction come down and tell Evolution they're old, get the fuck out of the ring, and again, nothing. Like the Bastion Brothers, you could have them down here be, try to beat the fuck out of Evolution. You know, an evolution kicks the Bastion Brothers' ass or get put them all in a fucking tag, an eight-man tag team match. Not a fucking thing. That would have been entertaining. You didn't have to have Batista or, or, or Flair in there too much doing a bunch of moves. You could have left all the Flair and Orton, I mean, uh, Triple H and Orton. No, not a fucking thing. Major waste of fucking time. Um, you reveal Big Show, a new faction, Big Show in the bar. Ooh, wow. I mean, don't get me wrong. I like the Big Show. I like the bar. A big fucking deal. Okay, that was a, kind of a highlight. Um, look at this, okay? Uh, oh, oh yeah, and let's talk for 15 fucking minutes at the beginning of the show like we do all the other fucking time. Let's bring in the fucking McMahons! Hell yeah! I'm sick of the McMahons. Shane's okay. Vince is eh. But fuck, 70, grant she was the first general manager role. I mean, SmackDown, that's fine. The truth, I mean, this segment went on way too fucking long. Vince McMahon shows up. That didn't even last five fucking minutes. It was worth. It was pointless. Okay, this is absolutely fucking pointless. You could have made this a backstage clip and been done with it. Okay, I mean, look at your fucking roster. John Cena wasn't there. The Undertaker showed up at the end. I can't remember. Becky Lynch, Batista. That. I mean, my God, look at all this fucking talent you were having. Going, uh, he didn't. Uh, Lesnar didn't show up, but he could have. Uh, it, it is, all that shit. I mean, fuck. God damn. You know, you have backstage antics. Hell, fuck. You had Raven Steer, the one of the better matches of the night. You had Raven Steer taking on Shinsuke Nakamura. Now, that was a good fucking match. But you should have known that I knew Mysterio was going to win going into the qualifying of the World Cup Challenge. He probably ain't going to win the World Cup Challenge unless he's got a long contract. He's only on for temporary contracts because he's still wrestling independents. I don't blame Mysterio. Mysterio, I don't want to be in fucking WWE either. Look how fucked up they're doing. Shit. A lot of shit you could have done there and you, and you wasted it. Now there's the confrontation. No rock. That Why no rock? I have no clue. You could have showed out enough fucking money for him. Sanity wasn't there. Sanity, you could have brought out Sanity to take on fucking Evolution. Fuck, and you threw it away. Um, right, okay, okay. Um, not okay. Um, Edge came back for, you know, the cutting edge. That was good. I liked that one between Becky Lynch and that. Undertaker came out the end. That wasn't too great. <sighs> All this shit was terrible. All the potential. He did good. I mean, but god damn, do I need to go on and on and on? No. Because it was that. Fucking bad. I mean, my God, when you would spend like 15, 20 minutes on evolution, and I like evolution, of just doing this shit. I remember when. I remember when. 
Let's not talk about our fucking arguments. Let's not have them come out and dress like, God damn, all... Most of that fucking show is nothing but talk. Nothing but fucking talk. That was a poorly booked show. Uh, me and my friend are going to get doing some um, mock-ups in the near, near future. We're going to get together and do some podcast uh, videos together. Maybe we'll do, we'll do one of how we would have booked uh, SmackDown 1000. But again, all this fucking talent. And this was the best you came up with. WWE is in fucking trouble. They know it. And they're going down. If this is... All this talent, they're just pissing it away. What do you guys think? Did you like the fucking episode? God, I sure so hope not. If you did, please tell me why. For the love of God. Tell me why it was a good episode. Other than the ones I mentioned, where you had Rey Mysterio. Like I said. So for about... Out of two hours, you had 20 minutes of good fucking um, shit. So for an, an hour and 40 minutes, you had jack shit. Twenty minutes of prime shit. Yeah, yeah. So as a, you guys take, um, that's it for this video. As I said, go down, like, dislike, comment, and subscribe. As always, you guys take care, and I'll see you all next time.